Today I'm going to talk about the Stay Wet palette. This is a system I've used for years uh, with great success on keeping my paints nice and moist. It is, that is a brand name, the Stay Wet palette, and it's a system made up of a cover and a container, and this cover keeps everything nice and um, contained and wet when it's sealed properly. And it's also made up of the paper that is right here. And then if you can see, here's the paper, and then this is a sponge underneath. So you can see the container, the sponge, the paper, and the lid that I just put on the ground. So that's what I'm going to talk about, how to clean it up, it gets stinky after a long time of use and it's sometimes just time to change everything out and get it all nice and freshened up. So that's what we're going to talk about today. Step one in this process is to soak a new sheet of Stay Wet palette paper in a pail of water or a sink of water. You want it to be really saturated and to the point where it's getting a little bit translucent. I'm soaking mine in a pail of water right now. Step two is to get the sponge all nice and clean. I know it may not look like it, but this is my sponge all cleaned up. I just got back from cleaning it with soap and water at the sink, and it is filled, very saturated now with fresh, clean water, and it's all ready to have um, the palette put back on top of it. Okay, here's step three. You can see the finished product. So what I've got here is my soaked palette paper now sitting on top of the clean sponge in the tray and it's ready to put the lid on at the end of the day and I've transferred my old paint from the previous palette to this because I don't want to waste any paint and now I'm all set to begin painting. So that's how you go uh, in three steps from a dirty palette to a nice clean palette. Let me know if you have any questions.